it's Ben here. In this video, I'm going to be doing a review of a new WordPress plugin, a new traffic WordPress plugin called WP Contentio and pointing out the pros and cons and going over a demo of how it actually works. What this software does is it does something new where it can uh, curate content, which has already been done before, but it curates the content uh, for, for you to be able to publish posts and rank in Google and get source traffic from YouTube subtitles. So I don't know any software that's ever been able to do that. So what it will do is you can search for different videos and then you, it will extract the subtitles from that video, allow you to customize it, add your own content to it, or for example, and then um, publish it as a post and rank it in Google for traffic. So, you know, this is a, a content marketing type tool only it allows you to not have to actually write the content and be able to rank quickly in Google. So I'm going to be demonstrating how uh, it works and I'm going to be giving my thoughts on, you know, just how well these type of content curator type things actually work in Google whenever you, you know, get to the hard numbers and actually see if they can pull traffic or not. Because, you know, there's a number of them around. There's not any that do it from uh, YouTube subtitles, but uh, I'll be giving my thoughts on that. But first, let me show you how this works. And you just install it. It's a WordPress plugin. Now they give you some trending videos that you can create, you can uh, curate here. But what you want to do is just type in your keywords. So say, for example, we have like a dog training niche site that we have, or we have a dog authority site, and we don't really have like a team to publish unique content over and over for us to get free search traffic, or you know, syndicated to Twitter and YouTube and things like, or uh, Facebook and things like that. So what you can do is you type in dogs, and you can go by the most popular videos relevancy or uh, the most recent posts. Then you can uh, show up to 24 results or eight now results. Now it gives us a list of videos. So, so we'll search click here. on this video here. And uh, right away, as soon as we click on it, it will extract the YouTube subtitles for the video and put it into a post that we can uh, publish down here. We can add it to a tray like posts to, to come or we can create the post uh, right away. And we have the post title. Uh, for the image, we it can use the thumbnail of the video if you want. And uh, over here, you can see the actual uh, subtitle of it, of, of the video. That's what the video is actually saying. And it also includes post tags that it uh, takes from YouTube vi from the YouTube video. And these will help you rank uh, for more long tail niche type keywords as well in WordPress. So what you want to do is, you know, you can uh, go up here and hit the spin button. And this will spin the content to, you know, uh, kind of make it unique. So let's take a look at that. All right, so now we have a spun version here. Uh, and if you read it, uh, what I found is that uh, the spinner was a little bit better than I was expecting. You know, sometimes these spinners, they, they spin things and they don't, then the sentences don't even make sense at all. But uh, you can see here, however, two decades of canine research have revealed that while well, bird dogs and committed spawn group after share certain skills, they don't really have much, you know, so the sentences make sense. It's not uh, that unique. But at the same time, it's not something where you know you're going to publish it, and it doesn't even make any sense at all. Now, once you have the uh, the settings how you want, now you can add your, your affiliate link in here. You can add it through here if you want uh, to link to a, an affiliate product. Uh, you can also include the video in the post even as well, because you probably want to you know give credit if you're going to just um, not even spin it and take the original version over here uh, of that. You can also uh, you can publish it down here. Or you can actually, uh, there's also a scheduler built in, and this will drip feed the content too. So you don't have to go through this manual process of, uh, you know, spinning it and checking out the, uh, you know, the, the text and things like that. Um, you can enter some keywords, and then it will automatically publish it on autopilot for you. Um, so you don't have to do any work at all, really, to make it hands free. So as far as my thoughts on how effective this is, well, first, you know, the major con I just want to point out is. Um, to rank number one on Google for you know a fairly com fairly competitive keyword term, well, you really need to have original, unique content because Google's job is to you know find the thing that's the most valuable and unique, and then put it number one so people have a good experience with Google. And if you're just copying uh, someone else's post or you know someone else's content and putting it number one, uh, well, they probably think that you know that's not uh, probably going to be the most beneficial. So it's difficult to rank for like number one, number two spots for fairly competitive keywords that can send a lot of traffic with just uh, curated content. Now, on the other hand, to be fair, that it's been proven that curated content can rank in Google, especially if you focus on more on, on longer keyword or long, longer tail keyword type terms. So, and plus, I, I don't know any uh, 
curation plugin that actually takes them straight from YouTube. Now, I'd imagine that those would rank higher than just uh, curating it from someone else's blog because the, you know that's a, that's a whole blog post that is unique unique in a way, so to speak, even though it did came from another video. But uh, again, though, you know, don't expect to get floods of traffic from just a f like a few days of using it with not much effort put in. And I'd really suggest to anyone who's going to use this curation plugin because they you know they can be helpful, especially if you don't have time to crank out unique article after unique article and you need traffic, is to um, add your own you know introduction, add your own conclusion. Maybe add some images and make sure to link to the, the video where it came from so it will be okay in Google's eyes, so to speak, so it doesn't look like you're going to get duplicate content or something like that. And there's a lot of other blogs that do that, and they do get traffic from that as well. So if you want to check out WP Continuo, it's going live, and the price won't be very much at all. It's pretty inexpensive. Uh, you can learn more about it on the sales page when it goes live at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then if it's something that uh, might benefit your blog and your business, you also get a bunch of uh, high, highly relevant, unique bonuses that you'll get from me if you end up getting it through my link. So, you know, to help you have more success with your blog and with WP Continue as well. So make sure to get it through my link if you want to test it out in your blog and try it out. It's going live again at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And hopefully this review video helped you out.